Alright guys, hello and welcome back. As you may have known for like the previous three episodes, well, they were all actually recorded three different times, but they were intended to be for one episode in itself. But because it would, would have lasted an entire hour, I sort of split it up. So that's why at the end of each of those episodes, it turned out that they didn't end fluidly with uh, basically an outro. But yeah, um, in this case, it should, I should be able to record now. You know, I'm probably going to do the same thing, so yeah, it doesn't really matter. But anyways, we have Naples under attack, Florence under attack, and basically the whole Roman, <laughs> that was weird, okay. The Holy Roman Empire is deciding that I should be destroyed. Be but gone. unfortunately for them, they, they're Come basically all their forces the are going to get wiped out. Coward. Just because I have like all the Norman Knights here, the, I think, yeah, Ch Chivalric Knights, the Muslim Archers, and the Peasant Archers here. The only problem I think I'll have would be in Naples, because all I have are Italian Spear Militia. Personally, I think they will still do pretty good, challenge. I think, but the I don't think they'll... Finest. I think if yes, the enemy comes back and attacks me for with another regiment, or I guess battalion, then I think I'm done for. So, I do definitely do need to push back in Florence and then send some reinforcements to Naples. But, yeah. And I'm also going to try something maybe slightly different because the last, basically the last, um, I believe I uploaded four episodes. Yeah, four episodes at this point, where... It felt like I was jumping around so much in time that it just the uh, campaign just did not feel fluid whatsoever. So I'm gonna definitely try and smooth it out. So this time I'm definitely gonna stick. I'm basically gonna come back every five turns because we're at, we're at turn 100, so things should be starting. The pace should start be starting to increase. And yeah, I'm just gonna do come back every five turns. Hopefully things happen for us. So yeah, I'll see you guys at turn one 110. Well, 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 would you look at that. The Holy Roman Empire is now going to try and take Naples. Hopefully, they don't take it. I mean, look at this. Look at their force. Three Ballistas. Oh my god, four Catapults. Oh man, they're gonna, we're going to have four Breaches. Just, <laughs> yeah, Catapults tend to not stop firing, so it's, it's a little bit annoying. They'll take down every single wall that's literally right, right in their face. But, yeah, hopefully I can hold them back and keep Naples from falling into the Holy Roman Empire's hands. As you can tell, the graphics are much better. I did raise it a little bit. I'm basically this is this is kind of a test, but so far there is no lag whatsoever. And yeah, if, it, if there is no lag, I'm definitely gonna keep these settings because it definitely does look a lot better. Okay, so basically they have their four catapults here. They have their seat. No, actually not the catapults. I think they're ballistas. Yep. Now the ballistas are basically just gonna do nothing. They're probably gonna shoot out the towers. That's about it. But the catapults are the things I have to worry about. And unfortunately, I do not have any any um. Oh no, why'd I do that? Oh, that was stupid. Ugh, I didn't mean to click um, start deployment this soon. But, whatever. Okay, so basically what the police are going to do, they're probably going to try and shoot the tower the entire time, and I definitely need the, them here. So I will have my spear militia right there, and have my skill trim right beside it, and another skill trim right beside it. Now I saw this um in a in a um, medieval two total war video I saw I <laughs> I saw earlier where they just had skill trim on both sides and a thick line in the middle and it's sort of held up well so I'm probably gonna tr give that a shot let's see how that holds and also have a very long line here just in case they do manage to break through but obviously will most likely happen oh. Guys up the walls. I know the rest of my Oh, I hate when they're so far away. This is why I actually this is why it was an accident that I that I uh like start playing. That was not a good for me to do this. The walls have fallen! Steel and valiant hearts must be our walls now! Yep, that's <laughs> That's really all I can do. I am eat valleys. Try and keep them there. The legs are right there waiting. And let's see. Are they also gonna attack? Hmm. Firing. Ah, right there. I better get my soldiers off the walls. Yikes. That is never a 
good sir. The walls have fallen. Steel and valiant hearts must be our walls now. You know, I completely agree with the narrator here. There is no way in heck we're going to be able to like basically take these guys easily. This is going to be a tough, tough defense. Hopefully, it'll they stop. Would they stay stop with these two walls being smashed? Hey, what are you standing there? We are over there. Oh no, don't tell me they glitched out. Oh, thank goodness. That would not have been good at all. Control's coming down next. This is gonna be a, yeah, like I said, this is gonna be the enemy are through the walls. Battle. Fight on! The enemy must get no further. I really have no choice. I have to keep it at this um I have to keep it at this what's it called? Um well, I'm gonna try to save it. Oh yeah, I remember now. <laughs> This speed. Just, yeah, um, there's no way I can. I'll be able to handle it if I increase the speed. Skilltron? No, they're not Skilltron. Oh, why are they sticking themselves out? Next should be this wall coming down, or this wall. One of these walls. I could try- no, you know what? They're, they're stupid. Yeah, they're pretty stupid. So, you know what? I'm gonna withdraw right back to- right back to the town center. Oh, I forgot to turn skill trim. Is that skill trim? Yeah, skill trim. I'm gonna have them all run back to the town center and defend it here. And the general will obviously stay here in the back section. Don't block. Don't block. I don't want to do that. I will have skill trim inside here. Okay, maybe not just yet. And we go over here. Because they're obviously going to have to. They're yeah, they're obviously going to have to um, try and charge through the middle. And if I can keep them, like if I, if I can force them back with infinite morale here, there will there is no way they should. Um, I will lose, so that's always a good thing. So I'm just sort of running. But you're not chasing after me. Okay, now I can increase the speed. Oh, they are chasing. Just a little bit. Yes, yeah, the only problem with um, time six on my laptop is that <laughs> it does lag a little bit. But I guess that's to be expected. I mean, this is. I'm not gonna say this is a massive map by any stretch, but it does get pretty big. No, well, I mean, there, <laughs> a lot of forces are moving all at once. Go from ready. Yeah, um, they always take AI always takes a direct route to the enemy, so there's really no fear of them trying to outflank me. Although, this is, I believe, the battle difficulty is set to hard. I think it'd be much worse if it was set to easy. But I guess we'll see how they actually handle this. There we go. And a very long defense line here, just in case they might break through something. And my general is obviously going to stay in skill trim. Just to keep them from break, if they manage to break through the lines, it should keep them from getting too far. God to save us! The enemy have the walls! Look to our defense, or all will be lost! They definitely do have the walls. Okay, Mr. Skiltrum General. Let's just speed this up. First line of defense is you. I just probably have, have all four of them in Skiltrum. 
Our enemy's ladders have reached our walls. It is time for butcher's work. Oh, man. I, I, I'm like a... <laughs> um, something stuck in my throat. This is crazy. It's a good thing, though, like, I, I forced everybody back just because that they have their catapults and their ballistas. Although, I don't know if they're bringing it in at all. I want to actually double check on that. Catapults and ballistas here? No. Okay, yeah, these... If they send a general squad guard in right now, they're done. Um, yeah, they would be done. So, there's really no point other than sending those guys in just yet. Maybe they'll send them in eventually. What is this? Why the setup so weird? Oh, here they come. Here they come. <gasps> no. Shoot. They're crossing them. Come on. Send your infantry in. Send them in already. Oh, man. Oh, I didn't even realize they had crossbow. Crossbow, man. That's okay. As soon as they send their infantry in, I should be able to... They should be able to... Um, well, not they should be able to. But I should be able to... That word. I, sh I should be able to use that word. Man, words. Oh my gosh. Why can I not remember my words? This is a problem with recording sometimes. Like, I can't see. I see with a lot of YouTubers that they forget. That they can't really find the words. And here we go. Here we go. Ah, no. Camera angles. Darn it. There we go. Oh, that's actually pretty good. That's of course is, is even. Okay, that's what I love to see. All right, let's see if they're sending any more infantry in. No, just them, right? And they're all their crosswomen sitting in the back. That's a lot of crosswomen. Yeah, that's a lot of them. Oh my god. Where are the armored sergeants? See, it's times like this where I wish I had. I wish I had um cavalry. That's good. Looks like we're holding. Looks like we're holding. Unfortunately, my spearmen in the back here are getting hit by the... Oh, they're both. Oh, okay, yeah. So these... These, um... Cro not cross them. Oh, what am I trying to say here? Italian spear militia. That's it. They're the ones getting hit by the... By the crossbows. Oh, it's shifting between balance. Balance, of course, is even the match, and the beat is certain. Our victor victory is almost certain. And a distinct possibility. Interesting, interesting. Okay, I want to actually pull a window. So I'm gonna just, they're telling Spirma, so they're basically meat shields for... I guess if I had elites, then they would be meat shields. But in this case, no, I guess they're not. Ah, oh, man, we're getting smashed with bolts. It's horrible. I really need to get these guys in loose formation. No way I'm gonna I'm gonna lose too many men for the actual defense. Oh, there they go. They're actually losing them. That makes sense. And no, I am not gonna send in my my reserve skills and forces. Well, my reserve battalion for militias just yet. I want them to come in a bit further. I just want East them here because eventually they'll start to the route and then I can force them back and forth towards the middle and have the rest of my forces basically close up which basically means tighten the formation and pr produce a wall. Unfortunately there's so many crossmen. Oh man. If I send my light infantry at them right now, there's no way I'm gonna be able to basically yeah there's no way I'm gonna be able to take them even with light infantry. Yeah. Basically the only thing I can do is hold up my defense. Although I don't know if I if I do manage to keep my defense strong, we'll actually win the match. That's the thing I'm not certain about. Also, the watch us first. Where's General here? If I try and flank them right now, I guess I could flank them, but the General would run me down. Even with spearmen, yeah, I would still lose way too many men. Let's just keep an eye on these guys here. Uh, light of two battles. Your men versus armored sergeants. No, wait, they're not. What are you talking about? The town militia. Personally, I wish you would send in their general already. Just wipe them out. Right here, right now. Protect Lawrence. Cause everybody to rout. Okay, let's see what else is happening. 
general's walk, walking, wandering around town. It's a little odd, but me. He's a general, he can do what he wants. And I am glad that you're not smart for bring your catapults in. That would really wreck my, wreck my defense. Okay, I'm gonna speed this up, and let's just uh, get things moving. They should be fine, even with the crossbows coming down at them, or the bolts coming down at them. As long as they don't lose formation, I'll, they'll be wasting, they'll be basically wasting their ammo. Wow, look at them go. They are defending, they are defending their homeland. They're really taking it down, <laughs> They're really taking down the enemy. Yeah, there we go. I just saw Tom Melissa guy down over there. Get knocked down. Get killed. Get killed. Well, I am getting wrecked, so that's never a good thing. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Hmm. I don't want to lose any soldiers in this defense. I want to try and keep them. Oh wait, did I <laughs> Earlier I said this is Florence. What the heck am I talking about? This is Naples. That's weird. That, that's just weird. I don't even know what I'm defending right now. <laughs> oh, poor Florence! Just kidding, Naples. Okay, this guy's gonna get wrecked. We have to get the heck out of there. Like I said, I don't want to, I don't want to lose as all the men that I can. I wanna try and keep everybody that I can. this. Avoid battle. There we go. Oh, they're fighting two separate regiments. See, I'm gonna call them regiments just because I still don't know if they're called units. Because unit would be a sing would be a basic. That's a measurement, right? So it'll be a. Si I would say it'll be a single person. Spread out. Okay, they have way too many crossmen for me to handle. I think I definitely am going to have to keep them out there, stand them out there, and make them waste all their ammunition. Oh, they're just sitting there. The cowards. Okay, let's just let's let's just um yeah, keep go let's just keep going. Wait until they run out of their ammo. I should, I will definitely have enough. And once they actually rush themselves in, I should be able to 